Low power resistance testing is one of the key features of the Hiyoki RM3545 resistance meter. Watch this video to learn about how to use the RM3545's low power function to correctly test signal contacts. The contact resistance of components used for signal contact varies greatly depending on the contact state. Because of this, the level of low voltage and current used for testing is stipulated by IEC standards so as to reduce the effects on any deteriorating contact service or insulation coating. The RM3545 is designed to meet these low power resistance measurement standards. Let's compare the measurement results from low power testing and large current testing. These are the results of using a large current to take the measurement. Now let's overlay these results with those taken from low power testing. As you can see, you can obtain higher resistance values using the low power resistance testing method. You can also clearly see the instability as a result of the deterioration of the contact. When measuring a signal contact using a large current or high voltage, the oxide film on the contact can be damaged, temporarily causing the resistance to be small and resulting in a false measurement result. Here is how you can make settings for low power resistance measurement. Simply select Menu, then Settings, and under the Measure tab, use the cursor keys to move to the low power selection. Switch the mode on by pressing F3. Press Menu again to exit the screen. Clip the two test lead clips together at the V to short the leads, and then check the display. Clip the contacts on the signal relay. The resistance value using low power resistance measurement is displayed. As you can see, low power resistance testing using the Hiyoki RM3545 resistance meter is extremely easy. For more information, please visit www.eoki.com